Hello, horsey people. We are back with Wild Horse Islands. Today, as promised, we're going to be breeding my most expensive horses, which is a good job, really, because I'm on Bella here, who apparently is my most valuable horse in my bag. So yeah, we're going to be breeding my most expensive horses. I don't know how many foals we're going to breed today. I have no idea. So please stay tuned. Keep the video going. And yeah, if you guys are new, welcome. This channel is for me trying to find or range. That's why I called myself the Lady Ranger Gamer. Um, horse games, equestrian games, anything with a neddy in it. I want to play it. I have yet to play Red Redemption. I have yet to play some really big major ones, which is really silly of me. But for now, we're happy with Wild Horse Islands and some other Robloxy stuff. So Francine, okay, Francine. Okay, I have 30 last two's left, that's good. But let the breeding begin. I've put it into value order already. So Bella is a beautiful crosscut. I kind of told you guys the last video about this one, so this is really cool. What a way for a Saturday night. And I hope you guys are staying in tune this week because on Monday it's my birthday. So we're doing a 30 fall special on rival stars horse racing because i'm 30 years old oh my gosh which means i started the channel when i was 26 okay quick maths i can do that okay so smoky and bella are my most valuable horse that's really cool okay let's breed them together it's not actually too much of an expensive foal that's random let's go first foal of the day oh my gosh i've bred another buckskin frisian no way Oh, I'm really chuffed with that because I love the cross coat. Imagine if today was the day that I bred a mixed match tail. Imagine that. Remember I bred one once and you guys were like, Lady Ranger, a mixed match tail. And I was like, uh, not a mixed match, a mismatch tail. And I was like, huh? Because it was typical me. I didn't know what it was. So I sold it. <laughs> I wanted to cry. This is so pretty. Uh, look. That's going to look really cool when aged up. So, just come out just like Bella. I'm really pleased about that. So, it's Bella and Smokey. How cool. Didn't think I was ever going to breed those two together. So, we're going to kill some time in between horses. Now, Fox here is a V1 Frisian. So, I won't be able to breed this one. But this is apparently my second most valuable horse. Yeah, exciting. So, to kill time, guys, we are actually... We're gonna go check out some islands. I still want to go and try and catch some wild horses because yesterday's uh, video, I tried to catch some wild horses and it went wrong. <laughs> I, was like, I caught loads of wild horses, but they're all just really generic. So if you guys have managed to catch anything rare lately, can you please tell me in the comment section below? I'd just love to know, okay? I'm not gonna know all your secrets, but I just need help. Ooh, you're pretty. You've got a silver mane and tail. Don't mind if I do. But yeah, just to kill time between falls, I'm going to go around. I'm actually praying that somehow we stumble, stumble across oh, a Mawari. Because a Mawari stallion would be wonderful. This horse is actually really fast. Why did I never ride this? I do prefer the new models of the Frisians, personally. What What do you guys think? Old model V1 or a V2 person? What, what are you? Ooh, you're rare. Should have come on, should have come on forest. Uh, this isn't forest. Blizzard Island. I should have come on Blizzard Island. Here we go. Yay, this is a Palomino Sabino Mustang. Nice. You can actually breed that one with another type of coat and hopefully get an island, uh, a unique breeding. What is this in front of me? Really, of all the islands I didn't go on yesterday. I didn't go on this island yesterday. It seems to be like the most cool looking horses. What's this, a gorilla? It is. What? Lovely jubbly. I can't believe I just found that one there. Nice. Okay, well, let's keep going around this island for a minute. So you have to wait four minutes between breeding. If we go on the fall hub thing, you don't have to wait any time at all. Actually, I could just do that. Why is it another thing of this? I can go on the breeding hub. And it's free. Yes? Or am I going crazy? Uh, okay, I'm going on the breeding hub in a minute. This is silly. What is this? This is very pretty. There's another Icelandic. Oh, it's cute. With the flax and mane and tail, it's like super cute. Aw, little inky dinker. It looks like one of these toy horses to me. Talking of toy horses, did, does anybody collect the Schley or Breyer? I know Breyer is like, it's a bit older model now, I think. I think Breyer was when I was younger, about 20 years ago. Breyer was like a massive thing. I do wonder if the Schley kind of came in and took its place. I don't know. I've got a few Schley ponies. I've got about 20 of them, I think. 
cards from when I was a kid. I'd collect them now, but I don't have any room in my house. My house isn't very big, so I wouldn't really have anywhere to put them. Um, but hey, maybe I'll buy a bigger house for my Schleier ponies. Um, love them though, they're really cool. Um, okay, I found a pot of gold. I found a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Let's have a little look. Hello, pot of gold. Right, should we smash it? Equip. Let's go. I have six pots of gold. Really? It's, it's funny, like, how you do really well on some of them, and then others you do just not do well. Got one more. Nice. That was a bit of income. Made about £1,000 off of that. I don't know how much I made off of that. I wasn't looking, because I'm lazy. Oh, let's just keep going. I don't think there's anything more worrying looking on here. This is so sad. I didn't even check the marketplace, actually. Oh, I'm going to catch this little quarter horse. Oh, let's keep going. We've got a paint coming up that looks like rain. There's actually a couple of horses that look like rain and they look like spirit on this game. It's crazy. I wonder if the game did that or the developers did that on purpose. Cause she, I think she looks like rain to me. I think. Maybe we should have a day where we just breed rain and spirit on Wild Horse Islands. That'd be kind of cool. We should totally do that. Okay, what have we got? What have we got? Anything worth buying? No, we did find one of those. No. Fine. Let's head back to the boat then. Actually, I think let's go to... I mean, I'm not resetting from here. No, don't be lazy. Come on. Let's carry on. I think we've probably killed enough time, but let's head to the Fall Hub, which is new. It's part of the update. I don't think it's an event. I think it's an update. The next event, spring event, is in seven days, though. I'm hoping I'm going to be back in time to record it and see what's going on. Right, we have a breeding hub. Let's go. Breeding hub's great. I'm just wondering if there's going to be... I mean, I'm on my private server, so I don't know if it's going to make the difference or not. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Okay, let's hang in there a minute. It's very pink, that background. It's like my... It's like my colours. Hopefully we'll get there. Oh, here we are. Cool. Seems a bit dark on this island for some reason. It's beautiful. I love I love what they've done with it. It just seems a bit dark on here. I don't know why. Oh, it's because it's night time. <laughs> Lol. Oh, that's funny. It's 4.20 a.m. That'll be why, Lady Ranger. Yeah, let's go see. This is Francine's Island. This is obviously new. If you guys didn't see the video from last time where I actually go and see it for the first time, I'll leave a link. Let's begin breeding. So this shouldn't cost me anything, no? So, I don't know. So Peach is apparently one of my most expensive ones. Let's have a look at the next expensive one. A Prince, apparently. I'm just going to see if the Rabacano one, though. Oh, okay. Because I wondered if there was, like... A combination of colors that might give us the option of unique breeding outcome but let's have a look at this combination if we can get oh my gosh the dream would be to get the palomino overo on an arabian but let's just see what happens okay so the theory is i don't have to wait as long on this island oh it's cute it's a little mawari fault what color is this no is it finally did i finally get I think I finally got a chestnut one. I did. I got a chestnut one. And it was a stallion, wasn't it? I know it's not purebred, but it's a stallion. No! My fault. Inspect. It was a stallion, wasn't it? I bred I bred a Mawari stallion. Oh my gosh. Okay, today's the day where I really, really, really... But I don't know if that's the Mawari coat colour or whether that is the Arabian... I don't think it was, was it? Because... Yeah, because we bred with Prince. He's just a chestnut. Oh my goodness, okay. <gasps> Tomorrow then, everybody, we might have our first ever purebred Mawari fall. But does it count? Because the Mawari is half Arabian. I don't know if that counts. Let's go with breeding again. Yeah, you don't have to wait. Okay, my next most valuable is actually this Fjord, but I need to sort the bond level out. Then what we've got stallion-wise is this Arabian. Okay, cool. So let's go with the... Let's find this... Fjord at my bag a second. So we've got this sort of fjord. Let's go follow. Okay, come over here, my little friend. It's cute, actually. So obviously, it's not rarity that creates the value always. It's also the training and blah, blah, blah. Let's have a look. I don't want to craft anything. I just want to equipment. Is that food size? Oh, okay, corn. Cool. Let's go quit. 
Nice. I've got five. Oh my goodness, it's gonna take a while. Ten. Fifteen. Twenty. Cool. So I have twenty, or is it twenty-five to breed? I can't remember. Okay, let's have a little look. Fjord, lovely, and Arabian. Okay, this is a weird combination. Let's try it. They are expensive foals, though. Oh, cute! It's a really standard Bay Arabian. That's okay, I can handle that. Nice, fine, really sweet. Let's go to the next foal, then. This is great, you don't have to wait any time. And I have loads of money. So we have a Steel Grey with... I mean, actually, this is the next one to do, but let's move on. Let's use this Frisian, because that would be cool. Oh my gosh, that is such an expensive foal right now. Let's go. <gasps> yes! I got it in a Frisian as well. What do we get, guys? We've got a Steel Grey with a liver chestnut, mane and tail, but on the body of a Frisian. That's pretty cool. Let's have a look over here a second. That's cute. They've got a lot of... It seems they've got like quite a few Arabian foals at the moment that are the cool colours that I never seem to be able to find. So that's really, really cool. Uh, let's have a look at my bag a second. So we've just bred along here. Let's go with this one next. Um, Let me get the bond level up on this one because... Oh, I haven't seen this one aged up yet. She looks beautiful. This is obviously a legacy coat on an Arabian. So that's really wicked. Really wicked. Lovely jubbly. Okay, and then let's have a look what else we've got in here. Oh, got this cool thoroughbred. No way. He's... I've got some cool cross coats going on here, guys. Now, I assume these are valuable because they are, like, cool cross coats, I I'm assuming. So, so I'd have no idea. Okay, let's go and breed. Let's go breed these two, then. Let's see what happens. This is a weird combo. Oh. I thought I just got... Oh, 25, you donut. I always do stuff like this. Let's go back to the Pinto Arabian then. Cute. Okay, okay. Now we're good to go. Let's do it. So it's actually molting season at the moment for all my horses. And I've got cobs, so I have the hairiest horses. And I'm covered in hair all the time at the moment. And I luckily I've only got one grey at the moment. The rest of mine are black. I've got black, I've got chestnut as well. <gasps> Yay, we've got another legacy coat. Another Arabian legacy coat. Ah, maybe we should do a quick uh, giveaway or a trade of that one. If anybody would like this foal, this new Arabian legacy coat, just put down in the comments section below, I love carrots in the comments section. And one of you guys will be drawn out and hopefully I can meet you in game to give you this very special horse. But yeah, let's do that. Giveaway time. Nice one. Uh, maybe I should take a little picture of our giveaway, actually, because it's kind of cute. Let's go inspect. Very cute. Let's go... Uh, let's not for this. Let's go zoomy in, because he's so sweet. Look at it. That's cute. Oh, it wouldn't let me uh, take a picture of the screen today. Oh, here we go. Nice. Yep, this one's being given away, guys. So, there we go. Okie dokie. Let's carry on. I think let's go to... Um, I mean, I've just bred loads of them in succession. I didn't know we could do this. I kind of feel like maybe we should do the 30, my 30th 30 birthday on here instead of Rival Stars now, but um, the Rival Stars I owe a lot to, so. Right, there's another Mawari potential here, but I should get the bond level up on her. And of course we have this awesome, oh, that will do a breeding unique as well. Okay, I think this might be the last fall for today, actually. Um, just because otherwise I'm going to end up spending all my money. It's going to be absolutely crazy. So let's just grab that nice grey Mawari out of the bag a second. Wherever they are. There they are. I actually found this one recently and I just thought it was really cool looking with the orange hair. Or should we say chestnut hair. So yeah, I'm really, really pleased with how this how this was found. It's cool. So let's try these two together and we'll see how we get on, shall we? Let's see what we've got. It's a really pretty horse. Let's see. Uh, let's begin breeding. Oh my goodness, I accidentally put us in there. So we've got Mawari, and then we've got this. And there's the potential of a breeding unique, but let's see what happens. I don't know which breeding unique this would be. Let's go. Oh, it's an Arabian with the coolest coat ever. Oh my, oh, we need to age that one up. It's a stallion, but it's got, it's a light dapple grey. 
that is going to be so funky looking. See, I don't think I've got any... Let's see what we've got here. I don't think I've got any... Hang on, there's bottles. Ah. Let's buy a couple of these bottles. I just want to see what these two horses that I really, really like end up looking like. This is going to be cool. Actually, but I'm giving away the foal. So I'll leave the other foal, the Pinto one. I'm going to leave that. This is so cool. Coolest foal ever. Let's see what they look like as an adult. Let's, let's do it. So guys, in the comment section below, if you love... Well, actually, in the box below. If you love the horse, give the video a thumbs up. Go on. Give this horse a carrot. Um, what am I doing? I need to go food. Growth potions. Okay, I'm really excited about this one. My foot. It's another cross coat. So let's see. Oh, it's pretty and also slightly strange with the orange hair, but I love it. What should we call this one? Uh, I'd love some name suggestions in the comment section below as well. Thanks, guys. Okay, that is it for today. I feel like I've spent far too much money on breeding. Um, these were my most expensive horses. Tomorrow, I was going to do my least expensive horses, but actually, I think I'm going to leave that to, for another week. Tomorrow, I don't know what's coming, and that's why you guys need to subscribe and put your notification bell on, because you never know what's coming. I don't tend to plan stuff. It's whatever I feel like at the time. So, yeah. Have a awesome rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching, and if you guys want to win, try and win that new Legacy Cope Arabian Fall. Just pop down in the comment section below. I love carrots. And then we will set up a giveaway. That'd be really cool. Okay, I think that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Have a awesome rest of your day. <gasps> Bye.